hell will be filled with people who are baptized. Hell will be filled with people who don't drink and don't smoke and don't curse and didn't have sex outside of marriage. There will be millions of people in hell who can make every one of those claims because not one of those things makes you a Christian. Not one. There are four main metaphors that the Bible uses when addressing the doctrine of salvation. The metaphor of marriage and redeeming a bride. The metaphor of slavery and someone being freed from slavery. The metaphor of crime and punishment and someone uh, being, being freed from or, being, or having, having uh, the, their guilt removed from them. And then there's the metaphor of adoption and family. All of these metaphors teach various aspects of salvation. Sometimes we will choose one of the metaphors and that's the only thing that we know or think about salvation. So it's the marriage metaphor and it's God's love and there's nothing apart from God's love. And we read passages of scripture about God's wrath and suddenly we have a dilemma. Do I believe that part of the Bible? 